Hello and welcome or welcome back to the channel. Today's video is just a little light bit of fun. Um, recently I showed you all of my must buy colouring book illustrators. So my absolute most favourite, can't resist, have to buy a book if they're out. And um, today's video is just about, like, you know, when you find someone new, someone you've not really seen before they've got a few books out and then you buy them and you fall down <laughs> that coloring book rabbit hole and these are all rj hampson books so i have christine to blame for this she bought me uh i think it's this one sometime a couple of months ago this moonlight mischief and I flipped through it and I liked the look of it and it interested me and, you know, and then I filed it away. <laughs> I filed it away on my bookcase. And then I've seen more and more from RJ Hampson. And my thing is, um, at first you see these hardbacks and they cost a little bit more, but they've still got Amazon print paper print. So you think, hmm, what is the point? And yet I have fallen in love with these hardback versions and spoiler alert i have ordered <laughs> his new um is it mountain king oh god damn it uh, i have ordered the new mountain king book in um hardback so i'm waiting on it at the moment because i'm I think it's a pre-order i think the hardback might be out next month so i've ordered it i'm waiting on it and at the moment i have moonlight mischief um and i i did like the illustrations in here so it got me kind of keeping a bit of an eye on the pages people were doing and the flips that i was seeing and then i saw serendipity and i had to have that as well that looked really interesting but then I was watching someone's channel I can never remember and around the world piqued my interest. I'm going to do some flip throughs of these, don't worry. But then the other day, um, I didn't realise uh, RJ Hampson actually has a YouTube channel and I've been binge watching a little bit as I do when I find something new. And then a Mr. Frogerty. Mr. Frogerty has really caught my attention. So then I ended up with a frog's tail. And like I say, the new Mountain King book just looks so interesting. So um, you have these just beautiful hardback books and they really remind me of, you know, old fashioned reading books. <laughs> and I think that's possibly why I like them. I do like a hardback book. I'm not going to lie. Um, I like that there are no doubles. Awesome. Thank you. Um, and you've not got loads of stupid pages, sample bits and pieces. You've just got this piece in the back that discusses his other books. And a little bit of info with a little colouring page, which I like that. That's cool. And then you're kind of just straight into the pages. He does uh, name his pages, which I think is pretty fun. Um I will do a bit of a flip of the books for you so you can see if you're considering new RJ Hampson purchases and you fancy any of the four that I have. I've just kind of really fallen in love with his really rather lovable characters. Um, I just, I really like his characters. <laughs> um, and as I say, especially... He's uh, Mr. Frogerty. I've got a thing about like, reptiles and lizards and frogs for colouring. I just really enjoy it. And this paper does feel a little bit thicker, a little bit nicer than the normal Amazon print. That may just be in my head because the book itself is just, you know, nicer. But I just super like these and as i say i've not had these for very long i have started a page um and uh, busted it's called love it this little rabbit thief and i am really enjoying this i have so far um done an alcohol marker base and just started on uh, pencil shading 
I've got Prismacolor pencils on here which are just working absolutely beautifully on this paper as I knew they would um, and I have um, done my white outline on my grocery I don't know why I just I've just I've been kind of working down in a way ish and uh, just finishing the elements up top I think I'm going to sparkle the middle of my flowers which is why I've so far left them blank but how much fun is this page and like I say it's just the characters I really love the characters on these pages and I saw um Lily from Art Journey UK had done this page and hers is so cute and it just made me like pull it out to play and I'm glad I am I'm enjoying it I've been starting pages all over the place at the moment I'm terrible you've got your book belongs to so that is moonlight mischief and then of course i have serendipity if you want a, a flip through of my mountain king when it comes let me know um and like i say i mean i've bought all of these quite recently and as you guys know if you watch my videos i don't often buy books anymore especially on amazon print <laughs> So I have to really, really, you know, it's got to really pique my interest. I have to really, really fancy it. And I have, yeah, I've now got four of his books and a fifth on the way. Love this. Love the kind of borders that he does to his pages and then the like outside characters. Yeah, there's an awful lot of different um what's the word styles themes images content to his pages love her so that is serendipity and then we've got around the world and I mainly love this because there's a whole lot of uh, you know Mr Fogarty info in here and he's done um, you know like the 80 days around the world and where he's a little bit of Mr Fogarty information there I just love that And uh, like I say, I'm just kind of falling in love with this frog, to be honest. And his uh, his journey's a little bit the way that I have fallen in love with my matchstick mouse. Uh, just love. Love this. <laughs> Book of Travels, super fun. Love it and then finally a frog's tail and yes i know i've got five books i've done one page but you know don't care <laughs> um love these just love them so of course when i spotted this a frog's tail and it's not he's new it's not new or anything i just obviously hadn't seen it i uh, had to had to have it And the Mountain King book looks absolutely beautiful. I have watched a flip through. So as I say, I do have to be a little bit more fussy about my purchases nowadays. No point in keep decluttering books to just, you know, 
replace with more books that I'll then declutter later. So I am a lot more fussy. This does feel like nice paper. I think this will be the one I do next. So yeah, I'm very, very excited for my <laughs> Mountain King to arrive. And uh, I'm super pleased with the ones I got. And I am, like I say, just really enjoying this page. Having so much fun so far. So obviously, I'm, I'm about maybe halfway, I think. Halfway. And, uh, you know, with an alcohol marker, the paper's quite... been actually quite enjoyable to work on with the Prisma colours. Um, the more I use my Prisma, the more I do like them. <laughs> um, I'm always, like, pleasantly surprised by the way that they move every time I use them. They're like an easy version of Holbein. <laughs> um, and just make life very simple to uh, colour and create with without having to spend quite as much time and effort <laughs> on uh, a layer when every so often, like even I can't be bothered <laughs> to uh, have to do all that. So yeah, it's... Um, reminded me just how much I enjoy um, those pencils and they you know you forget how nice they work on this paper to be honest uh, you really do so that is my RJ Hampson collection so far do you have a favorite book of his is there a particular one you think I should have a look at because <laughs> like you know I obviously need another one of his books for my collection clearly and apart from that guys have a wonderful week and I'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching.